Nickelodeon, do you know how time works? So, something's been bugging me for a while now, and it's just, ugh. Why were there three April Fool's Day episodes within two years, well, a year and a half of The Loud House? That's not how time works. It's, oh my god, why was there three? Like, I get it, the really popular episodes, but April Fool's happens once a year. Just like Christmas, just like everything else. It's just, oh my god, it's just... Ugh. But, it could have to do with the fact that Lisa did some crazy stuff about time, and a lot of the episodes seem to be kind of out of chronological order, but there's not a lot of consistency in terms of The Loud House, to be honest with you. <laughs> Everything's all over the place. A lot of episodes seem to become not canon, like um, the Luck episode. I've got the name just... The luck or something that that episode is a is a whole different thing. I did not like that episode, but that episode seemed to have been out the window. It's just ridiculous. And then um, save the day that was referenced once. No wait, no, it was heavy meddling that was referenced once. Oh my god! But why? But why? But why is it like this? Why is there no, like, there doesn't seem to be any canon, more or less. And the only thing we know is that ships are happening. You know, there's a ship war going on, you know, there's a ship war in everything. And it's just, why, why not try to make it more canon, you know, it's, it's, it's pretty tough, but now that season five has been announced, um, hopefully things will go a lot smoother in terms of the canon, because this show's great. I love this show. I love most episodes. I like all the sisters. I like all the characters. There's, there's, I don't think there's a single character they don't like in the Loud House. Each character is like that. In the Cuts of Grounds, well, I haven't watched too much of that. I really should. Huh. But still, it's, it's, uh, what, did, time doesn't work that way. Why were there three episodes? Next thing you know, there'll be two Christmases. Or two Halloweens. Two Christmases, huh? It'd be pretty epic. I'm on my birthday twice and only age once. Once. That'd be pretty awesome. Uh, anyway, is this, like I said, like it's, uh, Hopefully there won't be, maybe there won't be an April Fool's Day episode next year, but it's just, it's been bugging me for a while, and like, as much as I love those April Fool's Day episodes, and they're really well done, they're really well done, it's just not something that we need, like, it's not, like, just have some consistency in terms of the canon. Have one April Fool's Day that happened the first one, which was really well done, and then have the second one within the year after, and then have one in the year after. Because technically, if we go by time, Lincoln should be in middle school. Because he would have aged twice. He's 11, 13, you're in middle school. And then Lloyd should have been off to college. Lenny should be in grade... 12? She's a, she's a special one, that one. <laughs> I, oh my god. Anyways, uh, it's just a bit of a rant, but it's still something I want to talk about. It's, it's just, like I said, two April Fool's Day episodes. It's, it's, you know, you know, you know. But they're really well, well done. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Outro, stuff like that. Alright, bye!